Around the nation tonight, another tragedy has shaken a college campus. This video right here from Memphis, where a university football player was shot and killed last night on campus. And because of incidents like this, campuses across the country are taking new steps to ensure safety. Just a few weeks ago, WSU installed a siren and notification system on campus. And Eastern Washington University is a month away from testing its new emergency mass notification system. Simply put, in case of emergencies, man-made or natural, Eastern will send out a text message to either your cell phone or a Blackberry or even an email letting you know whether it's be safe on campus. And the word is spreading. It was the deadliest campus shooting spree in U.S. history. The massacre of Virginia Tech in April that left 33 dead, including a shooter, spurred administrators at Eastern Washington University to find a way to better safeguard its students and staff. Two months later, they came up with an emergency text messaging system called E2 Campus. Sophomore Emily Patey signed up last week during new student it's orientation. Really important, if just in case if any emergencies were about or to go on, everybody needs to be informed and. I have free unlimited texting, so I just signed up. Roughly a thousand people have since signed up. We're comfortable that this system will work very well for us in this situation if we do end up having an emergency. Campus Deputy Chief Gary Gasling says the plan currently allows for 10,000 users but can be expanded. And when you add up their campuses throughout the state, about 15,000 people could be online. So I think it will you know, slowly spread. It will take some time. School's starting up too, so once people get to talking and if it actually seems like it works, you know, it's definitely a great idea and I think it's going to spread around everywhere. E2 Campus was paid for by Eastern Washington University. It is free and completely voluntary, and it's not limited to just the students on campus. Parents can sign up as well. When you sign up online, you'll receive a confirmation code within seconds, letting you know you're in the system. Gasling says the goal is to get a message out in a timely manner. We all got that message, you know, all lines are tied up. You have to try later. But the text messaging operates on a little different parameters, and the text message will still go through even if you cannot make a phone call. Testing the system to all users could happen as early as the end of the month. To sign up for, for they, to sign up for Eastern's alert system so you can stay alert and stay informed, log on to KXOY.com and then look under news links.